everyone, Noah's Julian here, and welcome to Take the Road. Today I'm driving an Austin Martin DB4, my first ever drive in an Austin Martin. Oh, this is so cool. I love Aston Martins, I mean, who doesn't? If you're a car enthusiast, you're gonna love an Aston Martin. And this DB4 is just stunning. Now I've been given the keys to this car by Historics of Brooklyn's Auctions. This car is coming up for sale in their auction very, very soon. And I've only got a couple of hours to actually film the car. So they basically say, get out there, use it, and bring it back in one piece. But wow. I'm driving an Austin Martin. This is so awesome. So what are the numbers on this car? Well, it's a 1959 DB4, sold here in the UK by HWM at Brooklands. So in a way it's kind of poetic that this car is going back to Brooklands to be sold at auction. That's where I started this journey. And it spent time in England, then went to America before coming back around 1988. And the owner treated the car to a restoration around 1989. So this car isn't original. It's not matching numbers. Because in 2000, it was treated to an engine upgrade. It still has the original gearbox. It's got the original four speed here. And what they did was they took out the old 3.7 liter unit and put in a 4.2, which was bored out. It's quite an upgrade. And it was treated to triple carbs, stainless steel exhaust, 15 inch tires, Coney shocks. Disc brakes were done as well. So mechanically, the car was gone through. Now the way it is a pity this car isn't matching numbers because the original engine is gone. But that's what I find appealing about this car. It's not a matching numbers, fully restored concourse show car, which means it's a driver. It's a 1950s car, so you can't compare it to a modern car. You got the classic whir from the drivetrain. Steering wheel position is nice and center, but the pedals are slightly off to the right. But it feels good. The clutch is heavy and firm, but I like it. It's actually nice. The gearbox is good. It's quite snick snick. No, going in third there, fourth. It's very confident, it's very positive. I mean, the seating position is good. The brakes. They work. They do require a little bit of a shove, but they do stop the car. The steering is kind of heavy, but at the same time, it's all right. I don't mind it. It's good. You know, it's a nice big wheel. You can grip it. And of course, it's a motor leader, so it's nice to look at as well. engine in an old car like this, you want to make sure the brakes work. You know, I've been gushing about this car, saying how awesome it is. Is it perfect? No, it's not. It does have some cosmetic issues, 
a few blisters on the paint, some of the chrome is kind of peeling a little. The back bumper has been taken off because it was rusting. And yeah, it's got wear and tear here and there, but that's what I love about this DB4. It's a driver. It's a car you can take out and use it as a daily driver. You don't have to worry about it. You know, it's not going to be a concourse or store car that, you know, you, 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 you're going to be absolutely paranoid of anything ever happening to it. You know, as soon as the lorry passes you on, on, on the motorway, you're like, oh my God, I don't want any stones flying off the wheels and chipping the perfect paint. This car hasn't got perfect paint. But that's not a negative. It's a very honest car. A car you can just get in, go for a blast. And I think if I had around 300 grand to throw down on a car like this, I would keep it as it is. This is my kind of car. It's got style, it's got grace, comfort, but it's got grunt as well. So thanks to Historics at Brooklyn's Auctions for giving me the chance to drive this wonderful Aston Martin DB4. Oh, what a machine, what a machine. So thanks for watching this episode of Take to the Road. Hope you enjoyed my review of this gorgeous 1959 DB4. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, I could do this all day. But I can't. Sorry car, you have to go back to the auction house. But I'm sure you're gonna go to a good owner.